I heard that you are talking about water pollution and learning about water pollution and everything that entails, whether you're conserving water, whether you're trying to help clean up water, um, whether you are seeing all of the different types of water pollution and what it can do to our environment and ultimately what it can do to us and our health. Well, I have the perfect book today and it is called We Are Water Protectors. And with this book, I'm going you to listen to what the author is trying to tell us. There's a little bit of history um, that goes along with this book, so I want you to pay attention, listen really, really closely, and see if you would like to take a pledge of being a water protector. Let's go ahead and get started. We Are Water Protectors, written by Carol Lindstrom, illustrated by Michaela Goad. Water is the first medicine, Nokomis told me. We come from water. It nourished us inside our mother's body as it nourishes us here on Mother Earth. Water is sacred, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. The river's rhythm runs through my veins, runs through my people's veins. My people talk of a black snake that will destroy the land. Spoil the water, poison plants and animals, wreck everything in its path. When my people first spoke of the black snake, they foretold that it wouldn't come for many, many years. Now the black snake is here. Its venom burns the land, courses through the water, making it unfit to drink. Take courage. I must keep the black snake away from my village's water. I must rally my people together to stand for the water, to stand for the land, to stand as one against the black snake. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. It will not be easy. We will fight for those who cannot fight for themselves the winged ones, the crawling ones, the four-legged, the two-legged, the plants, trees, rivers, lakes, the earth, we are all related. Tears like waterfalls stream down, tracks down my face, tracks down my people's face. Water has its own spirit, Nokomis told me. Water is alive. Water remembers our ancestors who came before us, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. We are stewards of the earth. Our spirits have not been broken. We are water protectors. We stand. The black snake is in for the fight of its life. That was a great book. I love this particular book because it tells us how important water is to us, how important it is to our environment, what it can do. And did you know what the black snake was and what they were talking about with the black snake? Mm, tell it to one of your classmates or tell it to your teacher what is the black snake and why was it so important this particular book also if you get it no promo <laughs> but if you get it in the back of the book there is a pledge okay and did you want to be a water protector or do you want to be a water protector well there is a pledge that you can either sign yourself or I challenge you in your class to make a water protector pledge and sign it all together and post it somewhere in your classroom or in the hallway so everyone can see that you have pledged to be a water protector and why stop there why don't you be a water protector a land protector and also an air protector um are there any other protectors out there that you can be? Hmm. Why don't you make a pledge and make a difference today? Until next time with a great reading book. Y'all have fun, learn, love, and I'll see you next time.